Welcome to this Yu-Gi-Oh! discussion video where we are taking a look at the card Race Body Heat, which is an equipped spell card that has existed for quite some time already. It is only allowed to be equipped to a dinosaur type monster, and when it is, it increases the attack and defense of that monster by 300 points. Now, at this point, like in, in how Yu-Gi-Oh! plays out, this isn't much of a boost, and it doesn't give any like immunities to battle, to card effects, to targeting, doesn't allow you to do anything else when it's sent to the graveyard, doesn't allow itself to be banished to do something fancy. It's just an equip for very little attack and defense. If you want attack boost, give it a United We Stand for 800 attack and defense. And that's for everything. That's for every type. And it becomes 800 more for every other monster that you have. So, United We Stand well over this. However, there's some interesting things about Ray's body here. Um, it's part of, well, I wouldn't call it a series, because that's a term in Yu-Gi-Oh, but every type in Yu-Gi-Oh, except Psychic and Worm, because they weren't part of the original group, but and Divine Beast, um, all, all of those other types have an equip spell like this that allows it only to be equipped to one type, and then increases the attack and defense by 300 points. For example, here you have Mystical Moon um, for Beast Warriors. Interesting thing about Mystical Moon, it the artwork looks better, it looks at better quality, but if you look at the cartex, it looks to have been um, eroded. It has our equip only to Beast Warrior against 300 attack and defense. This thing is different. A dinosaur monster equipped with this. This, a zombie type monster equipped with this. Violet Crystal is the equip spell for a zombie spawn. I've had this reprint. Same with Legendary Sword uh, for Warriors. Now, obviously, the, like most of the types would have this word. So, what is that? Worm doesn't define Beast Psychic. Virtual Psychic doesn't have it either. They'll have other equip spells, probably. And the other thing, interesting thing about Raised Body Heat is that it's supposedly the first spell card that featured a monster in its artwork. And I didn't know this. Maybe I did, but then I forgot. But I, do, it, I didn't remember, at least. If I look at the card, it looks to me like Horn Imp. I'm pretty sure Feral Imp is a fiend, and Horn Imp is as well. But then, why would Horn Imp be there for dinosaurs? Maybe they're like, throw fire stuff on it, raise his body heat, and then it becomes a dino? I don't know how much sense that makes, but let us actually see. Um, tip space trivia? Anything interesting to add? DNA surgery to equip the skirt to any monster, that can be done with all of them, but then again, you could just use United We Stand. In Yu Gi Oh! Forbidden Memories, this card can be also be used to uh, equip to any insect wrapped on most of the fires. It was that oh that one yeah okay and then trivia first spell card to feature a monster in its artwork which monster though okay we're just gonna go to uh, we're just gonna use the page for mystical moon for this let's go horn imp I want to know this it does look like horn imp yeah. trivia on horn imp doesn't even have it. So I, I think it's Hornimp. If you think it's anything other than Hornimp, please let me know, because I'd be interested to learn uh, that it's anything different, but I'm pretty sure it's Hornimp. That was the Yu-Gi-Oh! discussion video for today. I will see you in tomorrow's daily Yu-Gi-Oh! video, where I should have another dual caster video for you of the semi-finals, the second semi-final match in the DNYCS Tokyo. And then one of the next three days, the finals will take place. Hopefully, I'll be able to record that. We'll see. See you tomorrow.